going to be streaming a game that um, just released less than a week ago called Tiny Bubbles. It's an indie game that I first saw at iFest over a year ago and I, I really love it so I wanted to highlight it. See if I can get it to play. So this is a game that um, is a puzzle game. It allows you to kind of solve puzzles, but the theme is really simple. Um, I'll show you with this first puzzle. So you're going to fill the bubbles with color, and as you get on to later levels, there are different colors and colors that you can combine. So your goal here, here, you have a blue liquid that you can fill it in. If I add it um, to one that's already blue, it just, you know, kind of makes it bigger. Oh, and they have added a tutorial to tell you that you can only fill the empty one. So, and your goal is to match um, four of a kind. So if you have four bubbles that are all the same color that are next to each other, it will just kind of like pop them and combine them. <laughs> and the sound that the bubbles make whenever you complete is just very beautiful. I love that sound. It's so satisfying and so peaceful. That's one of the things that I really like about this uh, game. So let's see level two. <laughs> I did the sound on the screen. Okay, it sounds like there is no sound in the stream, so let's let's see if we can get that working. So you can hear all of the beautiful sounds I'm hearing. I can hear it through my Yeti, so I wonder if I have to change the setting here. Probably. Yep, that's going to go to Yeti. Okay. There we go. Hopefully that will work. So I wonder if I can go back and if I can complete a previous one. <laughs> so what I was saying previously um, is that you have to combine the colors so that they all match up. So if I um, take the blue one here, I want to make all of the blue next to each other. So if I I don't, you can't see my mouse, but if I did it on the, the big empty one that is on the right, then it's only going to have three next to each other and I can't complete it. So I'm going to put blue here and then I immediately put yellow because it's just going to fill in whatever is on the left hand of the screen. And they have a, a really cool uh, color monitor that you can adjust it. So this is kind of a preview of what the later end of the game is going to look like where you can have different colors and so like blue and red can combine for purple and blue and yellow can combine for green and so you have like these really basic really intuitive um, color um, combinations and you can do a lot of really cool puzzles with them. So I'm going to complete puzzle one again, just so you can hear the sound from the game, because that's one of the things that I love the most. Like, just hearing it, it feels so zen and makes me really happy. I, they did a great job on balancing the sound design. So you can hear the water sound, which is a really cool theme element, and when I complete it, listen. 
just a really positive like light tone and it makes you feel happy or at least it makes me feel happy so puzzle games can be frustrating especially if you're not getting them right but like the sound effects are really calm really zen and and that's one of the aspects i love about this game so i want to put the red next to the other red and i can put the yellow there if i want um, here's purple and then there's yellow so you can just kind of quickly combine them together <laughs> oh and this one is fun so i just i fill in the middle and it's going to fill in more than four because it's all of the ones that are um, touching and in later levels you can do like a timing thing where you can try and quickly complete ones and then make others match up um, so that you can kind of quickly react and you can um, pop more than just uh, four so this is a really cool feature that they added as you are trying to complete the um, puzzle and trying to um, patch them up there's this fish here that adds extra bubbles with kind of random colors for it so it adds an extra level of complexity which is kind of pretty so um, if I add one then the fish will add another one so one thing that I think I want to do is I want to add the blue over here and then I want to add two red so and see fish added yellow So I moved really quickly on that one. I think I'll do that one again and take it um, a little bit slower so you can kind of see how the fish works. So every time I add a bubble, the fish is going to add another bubble and generally adds it at a random point. So I can add a blue here and the fish just happens to be right next to that yellow so I added it. And then I have two spots open so I can add a red. I'm just gonna add another yellow. I'm gonna add another red, and then I'll add a yellow. So you can add this, uh, uh, they use it in later, where the fish is constantly adding bubbles and your goal is to try and keep it in a constrained area. <laughs> so this one's kind of fun. So this one you have to get the timing right because if I add the blue and then I pause and add the yellow, I'm, I'm going, uh, here, I'll add the blue and then I'll add the yellow and then I have these two left over that that didn't complete. So like before with the sunflower level, you're, you can complete multiple that, that are at the same time. This one's very similar to that. So I'm gonna refresh it. And this one's at about being really quick. So if you do it really quickly, then when it registers the color, all five of them will go instead of four of a kind. And this is the first color matching one. So here you can combine yellow and blue in order to make um, green. So it's really good introduction to the color it's really hard to make a mistake I can you know like add blue to the green and it just stays the same color but there aren't too many mistakes you can make here so as soon as you add it to green you have four of a kind it's a really peaceful team and it completes And so this one again, instead of making green, we're trying to make purple. So you want to add blue to the red, you want to add red to the blue, and now you have four purple. <laughs> Same thing, this includes all um, three colors that you can do. So if you want purple, you want orange, you want green, and then they can all complete together. <laughs> I 
the blue icon shows your goal to beat the level. So this is the first time where you have to keep it under a certain size. So I think there there's a bunch of yellow that's available, but then there's other colors that are going to be available. So I probably want to go through and I probably want to add yellow as quick as I can to all of these red. So let's see. Do, do, do. So then I can get like this little zigzag pattern. And then all the yellow go together. And then all the blue go together. It seems so simple, but like combining these elements like that, it it makes it really peaceful to, to play. <laughs> So here's the first introduction with scissors. So you can cut the white edges to combine them. So before, what we were doing is we were, you know, like pouring a color in there. But now, if I cut the edge between the yellow and the blue, it's going to make green, and then I'll have four of a kind green. So this one I can cut and combine and um, it took me a long time to figure out the best strategy for this one but one of the cool things that you can do is you can cut and you can open it up so that you can completely remove one of the bubbles so now you can have four of a kind without having that that red pesky one in the way <laughs> So this is also a combined one where I can have all of these uh, orange ones and then if I get rid of this big purple one, I'll have um, the blues that can combine. <laughs> So now that I have unlocked everything and uh, learned all the basic mechanics, I have a couple of different uh, play modes that I can do. There are more complicated puzzles that I can continue on unlocking. Um, and there's like a whole bunch of levels that you can do. But you also have this like infinity mode where you can like just keep um, making uh, combinations. I think it's over here. I have to unlock the roadblock first. So, um, I think I have to do it like that now. Yeah. Okay. I'm just kind of breaking it up. So now that I have the roadblock unlocked, I think that I can play infinity mode. And this is just kind of like a zen mode where they just keep giving you more and more um, colors and the idea is like you can just um, keep building them. And every time you add one, you're going to get uh, the fish to, to add one for you. So I see some blue coming up, so maybe I want to add yellow, got some red, <laughs> oh my god, ticket, I want that ticket, hmm, okay, now I should have all four of those, get the red out of the way, Hmm. Okay. Got my yellows. Oh, I missed my ticket. Hmm. hmm. They're putting tickets on the side, which is just teasing me. <laughs> hmm. Oh. I don't know if I 
I'll be able to get the tickets that I want. I need... Hmm. I need that one to be... I can definitely get that one. I think that's all I can get. I would need to get the red and the purple in order to get those, but this one, the goal isn't to get them all. Although maybe, I think the way Infinity works is that I can keep playing, maybe. Out of moves, come back in three hours. Okay. Island. Oh, okay. So I don't know where the fish is going to add one, so I have to be slow and kind of figure out what colors. Okay, can I convince you to add red up there? No. Yay! There we go. Fish cooperated. <laughs> So here's the one that you fit it all into the circles. Boop's going to try and help. to fit into the circle. So this one's a little more tricky. So I can add yellow to red to make an orange, and I can add red to the blue. So there we go. I think that should work. Ooh! Hmm. There we go. I think that'll work. Yep. I think it wouldn't matter where I put that extra blue as long as I put it like either in a purple or a blue because it would have overlaid it. So, let me try that one again. Okay, so purple, purple, blue, and then yeah. You can't you can't mess that one up too bad. Ooh, brown. Okay, in order to make brown you take a color that's is not in it so you combine all three colors to make brown so if i have blue i'm going to want to add it to the orange because orange is a combination of red and yellow because if i add it to the purple it's going to stay purple if i add it to the green it's going to stay green so i'll make brown so red i'm going to add to the green and there we go Have I not done that one? I must not have. Okay. So this one's going to be a timed one. Okay. Can I, can I do this quickly? Yay! Yay! I got them all. <laughs> I wonder what happens if we do it much slower. I'm going to try it again much slower. Okay. So. Let those complete. Ah! Then you would get stuck. Oh no! I don't think you could get stuck on that one. 
That's some good level design. Okay. So I need to pop all the bombs. And I can only add one. Okay. So. I think this one's the one I want. I wonder if it would work on multiple ones. Is this one pretty safe? Okay, so I definitely need to add it to a yellow. Oh, that's the only yellow that's touching the green. So that was that was the only choice. Okay. Anywhere else would be a fail fail state. <laughs> I love the sounds of the game. Did I complete all the puzzles? No. Oh. I think this one, I, I, I can still do this one. Okay. Hmm. So I need to fit into the space. Hey, I got that one in. That was just lucky. about moving really fast. Okay. So I can do the arcade or I can do puzzles. Let's see what the arcade's like. Power-ups now available. Candy corn. Okay. So I need to fit into the circle and as I add a new one it's going to oh well that's not good oh it, it's grumpy because um it's really big so as i add a new one it's going to make it so that it is um gonna have a new bubble added so i got orange there can combine those together kind of cool. So you need to collect the right number. So it's kind of infinite, but your goal here is to collect four purple bubbles. So you can keep going on with all of the other ones as long as you collect all four, which are on the corners here, which is your goal, then you will complete the level. It's an orange. And again, it's going to keep filling in. So now we've got the middle that's uh, getting smaller. Hmm. That one's tricky. I don't think that's what I really wanted. I need to pop 12. Okay. Shadow bubbles, the black ones cannot be filled in or cut. Be 
purple. Okay. Hmm. Thank you. all 12. <laughs> but I can do that achievement a little bit better. <laughs> oh, I'm getting too big. from each other now. Got my 12. I don't know how many moves it gives you there. need to collect seven of each. Hmm. Let's get the greens. Nine. Oh. Woohoo! How many? Oh, I only got six. Oh, wait. I think I got more than that. <laughs> Sometimes spills bubbles continuously. Okay, so this one's kind of quick. Everything to fit in to the parameters here. Oh no, I forgot. Oh, wait, what? Okay. Oh, because it added. Okay, and so then now I just have that ghosty one. complete them all because oh but I'm smaller than the circle okay He offered collect 10 of one color and get plus five moves. Okay. Well, 
that's really pretty. Okay, so I want to also keep it in the circle. Combine. Oh, there we go. <laughs> okay. Get some more colors to work with here. puzzle. Oh yeah, this one's also really cute. So the goal is to try and help the two starfish um, combine together. So you need to pop the um, button, or the bubbles in between them so that they can find their friend. They touched. <laughs> All the friends are reunited. Oh, so this one's kind of challenging. Your goal not only is to combine the starfish, but the crab likes to eat the starfish. So you can't let the crab get in the same spot as the starfish. So it's a pretty interesting challenge. I want to make it easier for them to near each other. So that's. bubbles can't be cut. So we have... Hmm. Here, I think I'm cheating. Thank you. 
So again, I need to bring the stars together. I'm not sure what the die does. No, no, I don't want to shuffle. Nope, nope. Please don't. <laughs> I'm good. Okay. That's got a green. It's got an orange. An orange. Hmm. Oh, I'm getting too big. Too big for my britches. There we go. That should make things a little bit better, maybe? Okay. There we go. just about trying to combine the colors but you have to get it in the right timing too. There's a lot of balance that went into the levels and they all just feel really peaceful and really zen. So again, my goal here is to try and get it to be in that circle sphere. I think that it's really common for all of the arcade games, but it adds cuts. So I'm not sure the best strategy for the cuts are. Two crafts. Hmm, this will be interesting. Oh, oh, that could be really bad. Okay. Let's see if this will. I lucked into that one. That that was completely by accident. That one looks like a bear. A lioness. That's a cute face.
Oh, there we go. <laughs> It's gonna be tight. Can I get it? Woohoo! Oh, this one looks like an ice cream cone. Hmm. Wonder if I should just start making orange. Purple. Oops. I missed that objective. Okay, I think I have to restart this one. I don't think there's a way at this point to get it. Nope. I have to restart. Okay. So my goal is to get five purples and five orange. <sighs> Woohoo! Okay. Now I can focus on getting the orange. Five orange, five green, and five purple. I'm sorry, I missed that before. There, I not well thought out. That's going to create four orange. That'll be good. Give us the five of those we need. <laughs> I think I have more I can do in the infinity. Okay. Hmm. That's Trixie. So I can get that one. Oh, and I think I can get this one. Sweet! Okay. Out of moves, come back in three hours. A 
I don't think... I think it means three minutes. Or at least it's, it's saying three minutes. I think... I think there might be a timing bug on that.